Maria! Playtime is over! Hello everybody, my name is Exceeding Shadow and welcome back to the episode of Tales of Shadow X where we play a game for the first 20 minutes of your choosing of a game that I only play once and only once, it's not going to be a full let's play of it it's just first 20 minutes and that's all so, the first, well first game, well it's the first game ever selected by this user Captain Kangaroo, uh, 77 I believe uh, by Capcom of course, but if you didn't know that then okay but, uh, he wanted me to play a Pacific game I'm not really that familiar with, but let's just say it's a game we all know about, if it's called something different in your country. Hello, everybody, this is Resident Evil Director's Cut, DualShock TM version. Uh, what does that really mean? It means that this is the, uh, you can play with your analog stick, Director's Cut of the original Resident Evil. Now, he says Resident Evil for the Nintendo GameCube, but I don't have it for the Nintendo GameCube, so I t asked him, will it be okay if I played on the PSN? But the director's cut, he says, go ahead. So it's like, all right, we're playing Resident Evil, director's cut, thingy. So, uh, yeah, that's really, and I can't skip this. Why can't I skip this? Can I please skip this? I want to skip this. This is horror? Okay, this is horror. This is the most horrific thing of like ever, dude. I just want to play the freaking game. All right, we know he's gonna get scared. All right, so let's get a new game. Uh, original beginner art range. Um, I don't even know what's different. So I'm gonna play the. Fuck it. Original. Why? Because, well, I have no clue what the hell I'm doing. So we got Chris Redfield and uh, Jill Valentine, which, by the way, when I think of those two characters, I don't think of that face or that face. <laughs> I think of the actual characters I, I know from, like, Resident Evil 4 and up. Yeah, so Raccoon... Police department, raccoon, the police department. So I'm gonna play as Jill because. Just because she's like the main one, apparently. Not apparently, but basically. Okay. Uh, so, 1998, July. Raccoon Forest. Okay. By the way, I don't know anything really much about the franchise. Alpha team is flying Even though I have like. Four games of it. Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of our mission. No, I haven't found it yet. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. Bizarre mur murders committed in Raccoon City. By a group of about ten people. Horror in Raccoon, more victims dead. Bravo Ian. Team went to the hideout of the Star group special and disappeared. Set. The tactics of rescue service sent to save Raccoon City. Look, By the way, good thing is I'm playing this in the daylight time, <laughs> or I might be already creeped out just by this part alone. It's like this bird up is freaking scared of me. Team's helicopter. But nobody was not. in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. Wesker, I'm assuming. Soon discovered why. And that's supposed to be Jill. And I'm assuming that's supposed to be Chris. I like how this is like live action. Yeah, I like how this is like live action. And the rest of the game are like not even live action at all. Okay, am I watching a movie or? Oh come on, that was like the worst voice, voice acting ever right there. Or Joseph, like like she wasn't even scared. She was like more happy than anything. It's to say something in the freaking thing. No, don't go. And that's supposed to be like super like awesome, dramatic, awesome. 
They're trying too hard, let's just say that. They're trying too hard. Now they're shooting at... I don't even know. I thought it was a zombie game. Does not look like a zombie game. It looks like more like killing Godzilla because of that sound effect or something. Lizard, a wolf. What do you what are you anyways? I don't know. You cast Chris Redfield. Which does not look like him. Jill Valentine. Jill Valentine! Oh my god, she is totally not to ever. Barry Burton, okay, someone's online, but Barry Burton that looks... Okay, I don't know who you are, but at least he looks sexy in a way. Oh, snaps. Okay, now I know him. Of course we know him. Albert Wesker. Resident Evil. Other known in other places called Biohazard. They have escaped into the mansion where they thought it was safe. Yet, I like how just, I like how there's like, what a mansion! I like how there's supposed to be like, th like more characters. I'm assuming because of that little, whatever the fuck I just watched. But right now, I'm just seeing is three people. Yeah, where's Chris? Stop it! Don't open that door. But Chris is. What is it? I don't know. Maybe it's Chris. Now, Jill, can you go? I'm going with you. Chris is our old partner, you know. Okay, let me handle this. Okay, Wesker. Even though I know you're going to be a bad guy and like... Stay alert. Future things. Okay. Now, uh... I'll just talk about it when I'm actually going to get to it. I'm about to do it. Just, just wait, everyone. Y'all are going to be freaked out from this game. A dining room. A really weird looking dining room, honestly. Okay, everybody, so this is uh, Resident Evil. Now, I just want to point out one little thing that's going to bother me a ton, a ton, a lot. Uh, my friend Connor has told me that, that this version of the game. This is the return of the game. Uh, the controls are not the best. Let's say that. They probably say, why I get this version of the game? Well, it's not my fault because Connor brought himself on the network. Now, the way I'm walking is that I'm not just holding forward. I'm holding forward plus a direction at the same time. As in forward is a direction. So on the D-pad, I'm going up. I'm holding up. But I'm also holding left or right, just to make her go those directions, which is really odd, honestly. Now, I know it's the analog stick version, so let's try playing with that. What? What is this? By the way, it's also messed up. What is it? Blood. It's blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. Mm. I'll be examining this. Okay. Not Chris's blood. I hope so, not to, even though five games or and a half or something later, she's still alive. <laughs> okay, so let's play with the analog stick, which is just an odd game to play with. Open this door. Now, if I go that way I think no other way other way other way other way there we go this way we're about to meet the very first zombie in the whole entire game everybody Ooh. that is pretty creepy it looks more like a clown in my opinion than a zombie I know it's kind of messed up to say, but still, it does to me. Open the door! Open the door! Open the door! Open the door! There you go. He's like right in front of me, gosh. Barry? What is it? Watch out! It's a monster! So apparently, zombies can open doors. 
Well, we're all fucked if zombies can open doors. This is we can all can open doors. Is it? Kenneth was killed too. Maybe by this creature. Hey, anyway, Kenneth. Let's report this to Wesker. Alright, now that we figured this thing out, let's go talk to Wesker, like Jill just said. With this really weird control scheme. Because we all want to trust Resk. Oh, sorry, Wesker, right? I don't know. But we have to. Until he betrays us. And I don't know what game he betrays us, but he Wesker! betrays us. Help me look for him, Jill. And don't leave this hall for the time being. Okay. Don't leave the hall. Just look around. Try walking normal. Uh, no, that 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 that's the wrong way. There, there we go. Over here. Okay, I'm going upstairs. Okay, upstairs we go. Oh, okay, at least that's not a freaking thing. So he says I can't leave the stupid place. I'm trying to find him with the freaking control is dumb. I'd rather play Resident Evil whatever it's not this game. That's the control scheme right now. Okay, let's try opening a door. You have to search this hall. Uh, I, I thought I just did. Oh my god, dude, dude. Uh, Okay, come on, come on. Let's just come on. Okay, okay. How about if we try opening this door? Same freaking thing, okay. It looks like to me, Jill's like moonwalking forward. That's really what it looks like to me. Can I even run? Can I even jump? I mean, can I be like anything? Okay, no. Yeah, oh, snaps. Moonwalk. Moonwalk, everyone. Okay, keep moonwalking, Jill. We're going to have to go back downstairs because I'm not finding him. All right, back down we go. Okay. At least you're scary about this part. I mean, try to make it as scary as possible. Now what? Find anything, Jill? No. Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Beats me too. Now it's Wesker's time to disappear. I don't know what's going on. Well, I don't know what's going on either. No. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay. I'll try the door on the opposite side. So the blue door. This mansion is gigantic. Gigantic. We, get lost. we should start from the first floor, okay? And Jill, here's a lockpick. It might be handy if you, the master of unlocking, take it with you. The master of unlocking, even though I don't have a lock pick, really, <laughs> and I'm the master of unlocking. Uh, that's pretty stupid. Okay, it's just okay. Listen, if something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Okay. This time I'll be there. Or be squared, right? Let me just say right. All right. So let's go on an adventure. Oh, oh! Open the door, please. There you go. Let's see what I'm gonna get into. Ooh, whoa! This is ten times more scary right now. Oh, 
I'm moving something. Okay, I moved something. Wait, what's that over there? I must see what it is. A picture of a chumby. That's not what I'm only looking at. Wait, did you say a chubby girl? Oh, oh, I just see something. Climb it. Climb, climb, climb stairs. Climb the stairs. Please climb the stairs. Jill, climb the stairs. I see an envelope. Climb the stairs. You, you idiot. Climb the stairs. Fuck. Whatever. Just leave. Open door with magic not wanting to work. You have used a lockpick. Nice. Open door. Okay. Let's go forward. Oh, snaps! That totally scared me. I had to pause the game. Equipped. Okay, how do you get off? How do you get off? I don't know how to aim. How do you kill? No, no, no. Uh, stabby, 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 stabby. How do, how do I... Check. How do... How do I... I know what it is. It's scary music right now. How do I put to defend myself? That's a freaking stabby stabby! Oh, okay. I'm trying to stab. I'm gonna die here. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. You died. Uh, yeah. Exactly it. I died. How do I use... I'm back at the freaking title screen, am I? I am. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. I can't even press load game, can I? Is it going to load anything? No. How do you do all that again? I say, uh, no. I say no. Resident Evil, Director's Cut, DualShock version. Biohazard. Okay. Well, I say no. <laughs> um, if I want to play this ever again, I will. <laughs> but uh, not today. Let's look at those options. I should have probably looked at options before starting up the game. Okay, get ready. Okay, but uh, that's pretty close to an episode, I guess. Uh, it is, or right on, or something, but I don't know. Anyways, everybody, my name is Phoenix Senior Shadow. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, leave a comment below, and please suggest me another game for the first 20 minutes of your choosing of a game that I personally own. If you don't know what game I own, Shut game. Games I own. Look in the description below. It'll send you to a website called backloggery.com. And uh, you see all the games I have, and you can pick a game from there. Or if you know it's a collection, which games it's in the collection, pick a game in that collection, or just say a random game, and I might have it. If I don't have it, I can't play it. So, whatever. Um, yeah, but if it's a game already played, don't pick it because I have already played it, so there's no point of picking it again. And I'm not going to replay something I did already for one person. So, no offense. Alright, so, uh, once again, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys for the next episode of Tales of Shadow X, alright? See you guys for the next one. Bye! <laughs>